Okay, what I wanted to do here, we'll see how well this works out. I've taken my gun out of the uh, burner and I've set the nozzle and the gun assembly up like that. What I'm trying to kind of explain here is what we mean by peeing after shutdown. Now, I'll do a little bit of explanation first. When the pump starts, it isn't immediately up to its pressure. It takes a little while to build up pressure. It's a very short time, uh, but high pressure means it sprays well. Okay, lower pressure doesn't mean it sprays very well. That's not the real big problem with these things. It's what we call peeing after shutdown. That's a technical term. So I'm going to fire this up so that you can see the oil spray coming out and then I'm going to shut it down and hopefully you'll be able to see in the cardboard, you see I already kind of made a mess in the cardboard, where it pees out when it's done as the pressure drops. Because it needs that high pressure to spray properly. When the pressure goes down it just kind of pees out and there's always a little bit of air in these gun lines and so you have a problem with that. But I just kind of wanted to go over this and maybe I can show this up to where you can see it. Okay. It peed out for quite a while before it started there. Now it's spraying normally. You can see on the cardboard all that what I'm calling what I'm calling P, you can see that all along there. It's still actually dripping out a little bit. Now it's dripping a little bit in drops. So, okay, that happens every time it shuts down. And you notice when it started up on this one, it did it too. But after it shut down, it's a lot longer. Okay, what's the problem with this? Okay, so what was the problem with the nozzle peeing after the end of the cycle? Well, it does waste oil, but that's not the biggest issue with it. The biggest issue is you're spraying oil in there in a stream, and yeah, the combustion chamber is hot, and it's going to probably burn that off, but it's not going to burn efficiently. It's going to burn sooty. So, you have a problem, it doesn't work right. Let's say this thing cycles uh, four or five times an hour. That's an awful lot of time that thing is peeing that oil into the combustion chamber. And so it's creating uh, soot and so on in the system that is going to make the thing soot up faster, it's going to soot up the heat exchanger faster, and you're wasting oil, etc. So, what should you do about it? Well, it's not a perfect solution, but you can put a solenoid valve in the on the pumps. I don't have any of them here right now to show you, but a lot of these pumps come with a solenoid in them, and they're a delay solenoid. They delay a few seconds on startup so that the pump has time to pressure up. You saw it kind of pee out of there when it started. And then when it shuts off, it shuts off completely. Now, uh, sometimes there's still air in the gun line, which the compressed air tends to pee out what's ever in there anyway. So there is some loss with some of them with, uh, with the solenoids on them. But it's a better solution than not having it at all. And that's the whole point of this video. Uh, if you want to get your best that you can get out of these things, then you do want a solenoid on the pump. Okay, that's it on this one.